What is going on? Jonathan Hanst here in the booth, sending you warm wishes and love and peace from beautiful Colorado. Uh, are you like me that in, in a very small silver lining kind of way, because certainly COVID is not a, not a good thing. Let's make that clear. Not happy about that. But now there are Purell dispensers everywhere you go now. I like that. It's sort of like a sanitized blanket being wrapped around me everywhere. I will see a Purell dispenser and take advantage of it 99.9% .9 of the time, even if I've just sanitized my hands like eight seconds earlier. I'm like, well, you know what? Doesn't hurt to be safe. Let's do it again. So because we're into a new month here of August, I, of course, have a new playlist for you at Spotify. I do this every month, about 45 minutes of new and perhaps old discoveries that you've forgotten about. One of the songs uh, this month comes from Ryan Adams and brought up this question to me about how much artists should be punished or banned from our playlists if they do creepy things like Ryan Adams did. This came out a couple of years ago. He was texting or sexting a young woman and it's like, oh God, now what? Can I listen to Ryan Adams anymore without thinking about this? But this song, Answering Bell, is a great song. So I don't know. Like for instance, never watch uh, the Michael Jackson documentary, Leaving Neverland, if you ever want to listen to anything from Michael Jackson again. That's just a tip from me to you. Uh, anyway, tell me what you think about this. Tell me what you think about Ryan Adams. Perhaps share some music that you've been listening to lately, and I'll see you next time.